Now, today I was having dinner with some colleagues and we started to get into a conversation about work, but it quickly evolved into, into life, about how all these things happened in our life. And we started to talk about all these things in life that maybe have happened just out of like pure luck. It's like you only get one chance in life. I mean, everything you do is a nonstop, relentless grind to be able to achieve. And just like a fading light in the middle of the night, it only can last so long. The light bulb will burst and there'll need to be a change. And so as we were talking today, we circled around this idea of that you only get one shot. You don't get another opportunity. And so there's preparation, preparing yourself to be ready for that one shot. And sometimes you don't know when that shot's going to come. You hope it comes sooner than later, but really sometimes it might come years upon years before. So a good friend of mine has said, if you stay ready, you never have to get ready. And I honestly believe that because everything that you do every single day is preparing you for that moment, a moment that you've got to be ready to do whatever you can and do whatever it takes to succeed. Now, I wanted to now connect that to this journal. We're staring at another day where I literally spent all day doing a bunch of things that, you know, didn't allow me to create at all. And now that the day is over, as I sit here getting ready to pack and get ready to get back on the road, thinking about what I should create, this thought came into my mind. Now, sure, maybe these videos get hundreds, you know, maybe thousands of views, but that's not what it's about. I want to be able to hear my thoughts years from now, five, 10, 20 years from now, and be able to show my friends and family when I'm on my deathbed, this is what I was doing. This is the body of work of my entire life that led me to everything I've, I've achieved. Sometimes it gets really difficult to stay on that course. And I wanted to spend time to reinforce that, that I could sit here and just record and talk and maybe take some of the greatest moments of this last year and place them over the top of this simple, simple train of thought that I don't always have to go out and walk around and record myself speaking into the lens, that I could simply just go off the cuff about what's happening in my mind and hope to inspire and motivate every one of you to do the same. Now, I hope a year from now, I'm that much closer to where I want to be. And I had many, many talks with those that I really respect and enjoy spending time with out here in Barcelona that have told me and like giving me advice of where I need to go next, you know, what I need to do. But I've always have this internal battle because I know who I am and I know what I love, but I also know what everybody wants from me and what they perceive me to be good at. And I'll be honest, those two things aren't the same. And sometimes I wonder if the real me is able to do the things that really, really let me be ready for that one shot. I'd like to believe deep down that the answer is yes. And it most likely is, but I just cannot help but think. Is the answer yes? Or is it no? And so as you create and as you live your life, I want you to think about one thing. You've only got one shot and you never know when it's going to come. But when it does come, hopefully you're ready. So you should do whatever you can to prepare for that moment. Because like it's been said before, if you stay ready, you never have to get ready.